Hello, I'd like to talk about Symexa dust. Now, Symexa dust, in my opinion, in the opinion of many people, is one of the best bed bug killers. Does other things as well, but for bed bugs, it's number one. Now, the problem with Symexa dust, you just cannot put it everywhere. It is messy. It's a dust. So we have it put in, in areas like behind switch plates, back behind baseboards, frames of the bed. But I've thought about another way to do this. Now you can liquefy some exodus, which is labeled for it. So this is the four ounce container. So what I'm going to show you is how to mix this up. And then later, later we will show you where we want you to spray that. Alright, so right now we got the four ounce container. I have a pitcher of hot water. You need hot water and you need to take your time. This takes a couple of minutes. So we're not going to show you all two minutes. We're going to fast forward some of it, but I'm going to show you how we'll get started here. I'm pouring it. You might not be able to see the heat, but I'm pouring it in there so you can see some of the dust come up. Now of course, it's not all mixed up yet. But I'm going to close it up and I'm going to shake it just a little bit. All right, a little bit more mixed up. Now we're going to do some more. We're going to continue to pour small amounts of hot water in this material. All right, now we have got a full quart of material with liquefied. That four ounce Imexer has been liquefied in here. We're going to be ready to put it in this quart sprayer. And then we're going to show you what to spray it on. From now, we're going to go outside. Hey, now we've mixed this up. We're outside. Part of the noise, there's trucks. It's an industrial area. I've mixed this uh, Simex up with a quart. When you're mixing it up, leave a little bit of because there's always going to be a little sediment at the bottom of that Symexa jar. Uh, put a little bit more hot water and put this in there. Now you notice I'm wearing gloves. You know why? Because Symexa is extremely irritating to the hands. It dries them up. You got to see what it does with bed bugs. I mean, it's ridiculous. That's why it's so good. Bed bugs crawl through it and it just desiccates them. Now, this is part of the kit. This is a cardboard. Now think about bed bugs. They love cardboard. And if you have bed bugs, I can almost promise you, if you have boxes or anything hanging around, they're going to go for that. They're very comfortable in cardboard. This material right here is something that we shred. It comes in the kit. You're going to get about 60 square feet of cardboard once you stretch it out. We're going to spray this and then we're going to hang it up so it can dry. You're going to do that, not me, but I'm going to show you how to do it. Now, I'm outside. I'm going to put it outside on uh, something. I'm not worried about getting Symex on it. And we're going to be very liberal. And in the kit, we're going to have a, a bottle for you, too, on there. You're going to get 60 square feet of uh, coverage. And then you're going to have... Uh, a bottle to apply it with. Now you can see I am getting this cardboard wet. I got gloves so it's not going to affect me. I don't have to get it on me. And how much to put out, you divide it, you divide it all in uh, square footage. I've used about uh, a third of the bottle, so that's going to be about 20 square feet. That's all there is to it. And I will show you where to hang it. You want, you want to make sure you hang it where it's dry. I don't, I don't know if you can see this on the camera, but it's already white. 
on there. Bed bug crawls through that, they're gonna desiccate and die. All right, we're gonna, this is outside of our warehouse. I'm gonna use a, a tree to hang it up with, let it dry. Should take about an hour to dry, and then, uh, then you can use it. Hey, thanks so much. Good luck.